Hey, what's going on guys? Joshua here, and today I'm back with a brand new video. As you can tell by the title, this is an updated version of my item physics mod tutorial I did a year or two ago. I don't even remember how long ago it was. For this tutorial, you will need to download two items. The first thing you'll need to download will be the Forge installer. Click the first link in the description to open up the Forge website. Once you are on minecraftforge.com, choose 1.8, and I chose just normal 1.8. You can choose either of these, any of these options. I believe they all work with this mod, but I just chose normal 1.8. So you, once you've had that selected, you wanna click installer, and it will download your file. All right, now that you've got this file downloaded onto your desktop, go ahead and open it up. Once you have the installer open, you wanna choose install client, and then click okay. You should receive a message that says successfully installed client profile forge for version forge 1.8. Now that you've got forge installed, you can download the item physics mod installer from a website called Skydaz. You're going to want to click the second link in the description, which is skydaz.com. It should take you to this website, the item physics mod installer for Minecraft 1.8. So you're going to want to scroll down to the bottom of the page. It'll give you what mod version this is for. You're gonna need Forge. You can uninstall with the with this installer and it'll just download to your default mod profile unless you set it otherwise. Down here, it says downloads and you can choose either download here or there's an alternate link in case one of them does not work. I chose the first one. Once you click download here, it will automatically download the file for you in a new page. Once you have it downloaded, you can go ahead and open up the zip file and inside you'll find a little folder called item physics mod installer 1.8. You can go ahead and open that one. Inside of that, there will be this file and the exe file. You wanna open the .exe file. Once you have it open, you can choose which version you'd like to install it into. This is basically which profile of your game. As you can see, I have a lot. You can just choose Forge default if you don't have specific ones. Once you've chosen the version you wanna install it to, you can just go ahead and click Install Mod. It will give you the option to back up Minecraft before installing. This will make a copy of your .minecraft folder, and it does take quite a while. I trust Skydaz, I've been using it for the longest time, so I personally don't bother to make a backup, but if you wanna be 100% sure all of your stuff is gonna be safe, then totally that's up to you. You just continue with the installation, and it says that the items physics mod is installed. And it also gives you the options to uninstall the mod or reinstall the mod if you have errors with it. So now we'll move on to the review part of the mod. 